Hello, my name is Mark Pimitel. I'm a CAM application specialist here at Hawkridge Systems. And in this video, I'll be showing you the difference between linked operations and combined operations. So linking or combining operations is a function that allows you to kind of streamline your operation tree like we see on the left side here. So a really basic example I have is these four contour mill operations for the first four uh, Auburn pockets on this part. Um, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna link the first two and then combine the second two and we can see the differences. And really all you're doing here is you're telling these operations to share parameters. Um, so let's, let's link them and combine them and then we'll see exactly what that means. So the first two, I'll just highlight this first one, right click on it, and I'm gonna go to link operation in that right click menu. And what I'm actually getting it to do is it's gonna give me a list of the operations that also are on the operation tree that I can link it to. So at this point, we don't really know what link means, but I'm gonna get it to link to contour mill two just by sliding it over to the right side there by clicking on that and click link. And what you'll see now is the difference between the first pair and the second pair. The first pair, there's a little chain link icon applied to the icons there. Now, if that's not coming through on the video, you'll definitely see that when you do this because there's a little chain link there indicating that these are now linked. But what does linking actually mean? Well, if I go into contour mill one, now these were both generated by the tech DB. So they're gonna have the same parameters at the start here. And if I change just this value here, let's say the lead in feed rate, instead of 75, I'm gonna make this 76.5, a really small difference here, but it's gonna be noticeable once I click okay. Okay, so now that one has that change. And just for reference, I'm gonna to go to contour mill three. And again, these were all generated by the tech DB. So that should still have 75% of the uh, lead in feed rate. Okay, so now let's go to contour mill two, which before linkage should have that same value, but it actually has the 76.5, and that's because it was linked with contour mill one. So that's literally what linking is referring to. Any changes to one uh, operation in the linkage changes the other ones. So uh, let's see what combine does. So if I highlight these two, right click and combine operations. I get the same sort of functionality. I can see all the operations that are available for, uh, for combination and I can basically move them over. So let's say we're combining these two here. If I wanted to combine some more, I could add them. I'm not gonna do that just yet. I'm just gonna tell it, okay, these are the ones that I have highlighted. I want these two to be combined and it's gonna copy the parameters from the first one, but I actually can choose everything else in the list there. Uh, so I'm just gonna combine these two for now. We'll click okay. And now what you see is contour mill three is the only one left. But if I highlight that, we can see on the part, it's actually doing both features. So if I click the plus sign and I'll contrast that with contour mill one, by combining it, I'm actually just combining all the features under one operation. So this is a, a way to kind of clean up your operations tree but still getting that same sort of functionality because now this is one operation being applied to two features. That means any changes I make to the operation itself will apply to both features. But if I double click on this, what we'll see is we can still kind of differentiate between the two. If I go to feature options, I now have the feature list here. I can make changes there as well. Um, but what it does is actually combines it into one operation, kind of cleans up your, your operations tree here. Um, now, one main difference between the two is that I can't uncombine this. Once it's combined, that's it. I can't, I can't uh, disassociate them. But with linkages, linked operation, if I right click on it, I can unlink the operation. So now I, for contour mill one, I can just unlink it from contour mill two. And now if I go back to contour mill one, let's just make that change once again in our feeds and speeds. Let's make this point six five. Again, just kind of a crazy number, but we're gonna definitely see that change when we make it. Now I'll go to contour mill two, and it still has the 0.5. So I have unlinked them, whereas with combine, I can't uncombine them. So that's one major difference. The other major difference is linking operations can be done across setups. And you'll actually see that when you do multiple part setups in your assembly mode, there's a, there's a way to link them so that you get that same sort of functionality where if you are doing 
uh, different operations across different parts, you can still copy the parameters. And a good example of that is in a part file like this one. So we can see here, I have that little chain link connected, all these operations. So if we take a look at rough mill one for part one, I'll make that same sort of change here. Instead of 50, we'll make that 51. And if I just click OK on that, save that change. Now I'll go to the same operation, but being done to the second part, we'll see that it has that 51. So they are linked across the setups, across the different parts. Whereas here, you can't really combine them because combining means that you're going to put the, uh, the features together. And we can't combine features across setups. So the main differences between linked operations and combined operations is you can unlink operations and you can link them across setups. Whereas combine combines all the features under one operation and they can only be done within one setup. Any questions of this or anything else, just give us a call at the main tech line. If you like these videos, please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.